tell me about it. Like, is it guaranteed? No, it's, no. it's not guaranteed. So look, at the moment, this is a election promise by Labour and will be very much dependent on who gets in power in, the, in May. So look, but there is a lot of excitement around it. I think there's well overdue for some form of federal battery rebate. Yeah, okay. So if Labour doesn't get in, no rebate? Uh, I doubt it. I mean, realistically, the coalition's pretty focused on nuclear right now, which I don't think is going to happen realistically. I think you'll, you feel You know what? Way. I don't think they even think it's going to happen. <laughs> so yeah. I think you need bipartisan support to get a 20-year project happening, you know? So yeah. Um, but uh, but if Labor gets in, um, we will. It looks like we're going to get some really good battery rebate. Actually. Yeah, so. and look, I think the policy is very sound. And actually, yeah. I think this is a good point to just very firstly say bringing down the peak of the duck curve in the early evening is going to be good for everybody, not just the battery owner. Mm. It's going to bring down that peak power price for everyone. Mm. And yeah, and forget about all the, the the environmental part of it. Just as a program, I think it's been rolled out. I think pretty well. Like mm. they. Government uh, notorious for stuffing up solar rebates or any kind of rebates. This kind of feels like there's some issues with it, with it which we'll get into. Um, but this kind of feels like it's done well. First, let's get into the main point. Is it going to be means tested from what you understand? From what I've read, it's not going to be means tested, which basically means regardless of what your income, uh, as long as it's a new battery on the solar system, you're mm. going to be eligible for it. Yeah. Okay. So, so a brand new battery on could be an existing solar system as well. Yeah, or yeah. solar and battery. Okay, how do you apply for it? So, look, it's going to probably be applied for like we do with the SDC rebate with the panels. So, most likely it'll be it'll come off your total um, invoice after the solar is installed. So, you don't apply for it. The customer doesn't apply for it. No, by the, look, if it's anything like the solar rebate scheme, it, the customer is not going to be applying for them it, themselves. And and that's exactly what we've been told. It's going to be run through that STC claim, the, the solar rebate scheme, yep. which is a point of sale discount. So your solar system might cost fifteen grand. We sell it to you for, for ten grand and get five grand off the rebate yep. uh, off the government. It'll be similar to that, right? Yeah. So you'll be paying a gap payment. So it's going to be part of that small technology certificate scheme. Which is um, yeah, very exciting. So the big question then is how much are we talking? Do we know the details about that? It's a bit vague. 